Hi everybody, it's Beth, and today I'll be making a fall door hanger. I used some of these burlap leaves from Dollar Tree. This stencil I got from Amazon. A pizza pan from Dollar Tree, mineral chalk paint and barn red, acrylic paint and hot glue. I started by sanding the pizza pan just to make the paint adhere a little better. And then I painted the entire pizza pan front and back with the mineral chalk paint. And I did two coats drying it in between. Next, once that was dry, I took my stencil and put it on the center of the pizza pan and then took the barn red acrylic paint and I just did a little bit of paint at a time and just kind of dabbed it on the stencil until the entire thing was covered. Next, I added some hot glue to the very rim of the pizza pan and hot glue down the burlap leaves. I only ended up using three of the colors. I didn't use the orange ones. And I just went around and hot glued, kind of alternating the colors until the entire rim was covered. And then took some more leaves and hot glued them on top of those first sets, just a little bit more inward towards the center and did another row uh, just like the first one. And then once I had it all filled in, I decided I wanted a bow. So I just took some ribbons that were similar in color. They were both from Dollar Tree. And I started a loop, maybe about eight inches and then folded it and then just kept wrapping it around itself until I had about four loops and then just cut off the excess. And then I did the same thing to the next one, just maybe a little bit smaller, maybe about seven inches and had my four loops. And then once I had both of those done, I cut out little triangles on both sides right in the center and that's where I'll attach my twine. That's just so you can move around the ribbons, the loops a little bit better. So then I just attached my twine to the center, pulling it nice and tight, wrapping it around a couple times and just knotting it. And I did that on both of those sets of ribbon. And then I just opened up all of the ribbon and made the loops nice and fluffy. And then I just left the twine on there nice and long so I could connect them together. So I just took my ribbon that was slightly smaller and put it on the front and wrapped that twine around the other larger set. And then took the same ribbons, cut two long strips. I did not measure just cut it how long I wanted the tail, twisted them in the center, tied some twine around it, and left the twine long again so I could attach it with that twine. Just kind of 
picked up one of the sets of ribbon and tied it in between those two sets and then cut off the excess twine. And then I just tailed all of my ends of my ribbon. And then before I attached the bow, I had to make a hanger. So I just flipped the pizza pan over, making sure that it was going to be centered before I flipped it. And then hot glued it to the back of the pan, took some burlap ribbon, and hot glued it right over the twine to hold it into place. And then flipped it back over and attached my bow with some hot glue. And that is it. Very simple, but looks really adorable. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video.